Hi, I'm Kenneth Montague. I'm a dentist in Toronto, but also an art collector and curator, founder and director of Wedge Curatorial Projects, based in Toronto. Well, I grew up, uh, I was born and grew up in Windsor, Ontario, across from Detroit. My parents were from Jamaica, and they were very artistic, and uh, my dad was actually doing a master's in industrial arts uh, in Detroit. Uh, it was the 1960s I was born in, and it was an era of kind of black empowerment, mostly in, the, in America, this sort of uh, black power movement really informed my view of what I considered art. And so I would go to the Detroit Institute of Arts even as a 10 year old uh, in the 70s and sort of like really uh, get into the moment of you know seeing these images of uh, African Americans that seem kind of impossibly sophisticated to me, like people you know in Harlem in the 1920s and so forth. And it set me on a journey of discovery or self-discovery about black culture around the world. So, Photography was an accessible thing to someone who didn't have any formal art training. I got invited to an art fair in Madrid called Arco. That was in February of 2009. I first discovered at the booth of uh, Stevenson Gallery from South Africa this wonderful new work from their artist Guy Tillip. You know, people like Guy Tillip who have a background in photojournalism uh, have a brain that sort of uh, is analytical and have a creative uh, soul are, are going to be able to still rise to the top and create images that are informed by all that kind of particular background. And of course him being African is also essential to the, the particular vision of Africa they create. So it's an example, Guy Tillum still moves us in a way that if say you or I were taking these pictures, I'm not sure we'd get that same feel, that same uh, kind of uh, depth and quality that he's achieving.